Abuela, what's happening? I don't know, Rosa. Maybe something is wrong. The car has stopped and we can't get it to start again. Oh. Oh. Mm. Oh. Ah. This is gonna take a while. Well, in that case, I think I'll go and get some air. I'll go too, Mama. What is it, Abuela? Oh, Rosa, it's nothing. I'm just remembering. Remembering what? I was remembering how things were when I was a girl. When I was 10, we moved from the ranch we work on in Mexico to a farm in California. It wasn't very far from here. We lived with many other families there in the camp. The grown-ups all picked or packed crops, peaches, nectarines, grapes, asparagus, and potatoes. There were many of them. The produce went to feed people not only in California, but all over the country and the world. I watched my little brothers. I cooked and did camp chores until I was 13. And then I worked in the packing house with the women. That sounds like a lot of hard work, Abuelita. It was. This was in the 1930s and the country was in the middle of the Great Depression. Many people were very poor. Everyone at the camp was. And with so many people jobless, we were glad to have our jobs. We share what we had to get used to our new life. When I started school, I had to learn English. That was a struggle for me. Oh, Abuela. I had many good memories of that time. We made many friends at the camp. We were a community whose life circled around the crops. Every Saturday night in the summer, we would have a fiesta. I have many memories of those fiestas and the peaches. Oh, how I remember eating peaches with the other girls in the camp. We would bite into them and the juice would dribble down our chins. But that was long ago. Oh yes, we had our rough times. But looking back, I wouldn't trade any part of it. When you life circles around the crops, you feel an affinity with the earth. It's powerful. This one little part of California, the Central Valley, produces much of the produce for millions of people. Central California is an essential part of the nation's agricultural production. Mama, Rosa, come on, we've got it working. Abuelita, wait for me.